Uh, Mark Hogan, I think he at least has private sector and uh, financial experience, that's good. I would have rather, frankly, we would have done what the Be Bold Advisory Committee suggested, which is to pick world-class leadership, somebody that's successfully run an economic development agency. After all, we're you know, 35th, 37th, depending on how you, you measure it, um, but in jobs. So we clearly need an overhaul here. Um, so I, I'm glad we have new leadership. Um, I, I think Mr. Hogan will, uh, has all the potential to do a good job. I look forward to working with them, but we clearly need significant statutory changes. Robin, does your team want to give Mr. Hogan a chance at WEDIC uh, before you, that you make any more statutory changes? Well, I do agree with Peter that there are definite issues that need to be addressed. Um, that's why, even though some in my party have proposed taking legislators off the WEDIC board, I've opposed that effort. I think it's good to have people watching out for taxpayers in both elected mm -hmm. and private sector roles. I think that's good. Um, I think Mr. Hogan seems like I've never met him, so I can't say that I know anything about him more than what I've read in the news reports, but he seems like a very capable, able person who's going to be able to take this agency and take it up a notch. Uh, I think WEDIC does many good things, but I think there are many things things that need to improve. Uh, I think that's part of what, unfortunately, people have made Weedick into kind of a partisan punching bag. And I think that's really unfortunate because there is nothing that's more important than creating jobs. And figuring a way to try to improve the agency should be something that's done on a bipartisan basis. But it seems, unfortunately, like Republicans often defend the agency and Democrats often attack it. And probably on both aspects, it'd be awfully nice if we could figure out a way to work together, make the agency as effective as it possibly could be, kind of put down the swords and figure out a way to make it work.